Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brittany. So today I am so excited because we are cash stuffing my YouTube paycheck. Yay! I haven't had one in months, so I am so excited to have received one this month. The way YouTube works is that you have to reach a $100 threshold before they pay you out. Um, because I've been making a lot less money. I took a step back on YouTube um, in earlier January and it really affected um, my channel. So I have been making a lot less money on this platform. So this is the first time in about two or three months that I've gotten a YouTube paycheck. So we are cash stuffing $108. And I just wanna say thank you guys so much. Um, obviously without you guys watching my videos, liking, commenting, um, subscribing, all of that, I would not have this check. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm so excited. Okay, let's just go ahead and dive right into the cash stuffing. So I decided to um, kind of be strategic about this check. I didn't want to hit really bills. I kind of wanted to use this as like a bonus check since I hardly ever get this. I do need to put taxes aside though because it is taxed income. Um, of this, I am going to be 20, putting $20 into taxes. So there is 500 in the bank, 600, 700, 800, 900, 1000, 1100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93. So 1,193 dollars is what is in taxes here, which is insane. And as promised, that um, bill exchange video will be coming out very, very soon. Okay, supplies is going to be eating $30 today. And this is honestly just paying myself back. Um, after this, I still owe myself $10 and then I will be paid off um, for what I have spent on my business so far. Mama Bird Budgets, I'm so excited. This is finally getting stuffed after months and months. I will be putting $10 towards this. Um, this is basically anything I would need for my channel. So I would like to get better lighting than what I have now. Um, I basically just have like yellow lights above my head and I would like to switch that for um, better lighting, like a white, bright light so that when I film it looks much nicer um, so I'm gonna slowly add towards that and I'm sorry about my nails like I just noticed how awful they look but I have been like washing berries and stuff so they kind of dyed my fingernails so that's where we're at with that okay um peel box is going to be getting five dollars so it now has 20 30 40 50 and 55 I really wanted to take this check and kind of um Put a lot of it towards my business so that my when I get paid from Etsy, I can kind of put that towards my bills and stuff. So Amazon is also going to be eating five dollars today. Whoops. So it now has 20, 30, 35, 40, and 45 dollars in there. And that is it for my um, business finder. I did want to go ahead and take care of that, but I will be putting um, more money towards like my savings challenges and my sinking fund, so I'm very excited about that. I feel like I'm like flying through this video, but I'm just really excited, you guys, <laughs> if you can't tell. Okay, so I will be going into my bills binder and I will be hitting up just one category in here. Um, and that is one month ahead. I did want to put some money towards um, my future bills in here and we are gonna be adding, I believe, Oh, let me just do this really quick. Yeah, I'm gonna be adding 10. So I'm gonna put this 20 in and put this 10 back. So we have $60 now in one month ahead, which makes me feel really good. Um, this is just, I'm hoping that what I can do is get one month ahead on my bills, which would be about between 500 and $550 in here. And then of course I would love to um, save for like two, three or so months ahead. But for now, that is great. And I know I talked about adding a category for myself, and I will be. I'm not going to be doing it in this video, but my next like regular weekly cash stuffing, I will be adding that category for myself because if you don't know, I am currently pregnant with my second baby. Um, and it's a bit different timing than when I was pregnant with my son, like weather-wise. So I am not used to being this pregnant in the summer in this heat so I do need to buy me some like cooler maternity clothes um, where I live it gets very very hot um, I think since about the beginning or mid uh, May we have had about three 
maybe four weeks of just 100 plus degree weather. It is too hot. I am too pregnant for this. So I needed a category for myself to, um, let me just keep moving on, <laughs> to kind of build my little maternity wardrobe. I don't want to spend too much because I know I'm not going to be spending that much longer in maternity clothes, but I do want to be comfortable during the summer. And I didn't want to take from um, the baby's fund. I want to use this strictly on like the stuff we need for the baby. Okay, so I am going to be putting a little bit of money in here. And I'm just going to hit up a couple funds that like get neglected often. So for Gabies, I'm going to be putting this dollar back and adding a five because I did want to add enough to like kind of even this one out. So we have 500 in the bank, 600, 620, 640, 650, and 655 is what Gaby has now. Unfortunately, this is like taking a back seat since what I've been making, um, I basically have just been covering bills, especially with everything increasing. Um, gifts, that one is getting skipped. We're gonna go all the way to retirement. This unfortunately has um, been put on the back burner as well. So we are gonna be adding a couple dollars to here. We're gonna add $2, which makes retirement at 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. And again, I pull from this every month, which is why it's constantly going up and down, up and down, because I take out $25 every month to put towards retirement. Okay, that is it for that. And we're gonna be moving on to here. I decided I wanted to put a decent amount towards my saving challenges because I usually only add a couple dollars here and there. So our $500 savings challenge, let's go ahead and get this out real quick. I will get my pen. And we are gonna be adding $15 to here, which is great. And before I forget, I'm gonna mark off a 10 and a five on here. Okay, so our $500 savings challenge now has 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 300, 305, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. So 315, I'm very happy about that. We are well on our way. So my original goal was to complete this and the $1,000 challenge this year. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that. <laughs> we are like halfway through the year and I haven't quite finished this one yet. So we are going to attempt it, but no promises. Um, let's see, our Christmas challenge. This is going to be getting the remaining $7 in here. And again, I'm gonna mark it off before I forget. I need my other pin though. So it's gonna be a five and a two. So our second go around in here, because we have completed this once already, has 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. So total we have 325 in our envelope here, um, but I have spent out of here. So once this tracker is filled, I know that total I will have saved $600 towards Christmas. And then we don't have anything to add to these this week. And that is it. I know I kind of flew through this, but I was very excited to go ahead and do like, it basically was a bonus cash stuffing. Blah, 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 blah. It basically was a bonus cash stuffing for me because I have not received this in a while. So I haven't been relying on any money from YouTube, basically just my Etsy. So this was definitely a blessing to get. So I did, like I said, wanted to kind of fill my business binder and also like my savings slash sinking funds as well. Um, so thank you guys so much for joining me. Thank you for watching my videos, for commenting, subscribing, liking. That All of that stuff seriously helps, like watching the ads. Just thank you guys so much. I truly, truly appreciate all of you. Okay, I'm going to stop rambling. I will see you in my next video. Thank you guys so much. Okay, bye. Thank you.